This is a demonstration video of the Echo Record Player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. When you receive it, the first thing to do is screw down the two transit screws on the deck located here and here. Screw those all the way down fully clockwise so the deck floats on its springs. And also remember to unclip the arm. The three main controls for the amplifier are on the front, marked treble bass and volume, and the mains power switches on and off automatically when the turntable stops and starts. On the deck you have the speed control here, stop start switch here, and size selection here on the right hand side for 7, 10 or 12 inch records. You can load between 1 and 6 records, I'll demonstrate with 2, just so you can see it play. Pop the records onto the spindle edge and put the stacker arm across and flick the switch to auto to start the auto changer. switch to the next record, just flick the switch to auto again and the next record will play. Just demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually you can just place an individual record down the spindle onto the mat and with the stacker bar in the upright position as shown here you can flick the switch to auto and the arm will go across and play or you can select manual start and then place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, carefully lower the stacker arm down so it knows to switch off when it reaches the end of the record. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar in the upright position as pictured here, that triggers a repeat function and the same record will play over again. So I hope that covers everything for you, but if you do have any questions when you receive it, I'll include my personal email address in with the machine and please use that method to contact me.